for everyone. For everyone doing well. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Maths by Pinch Tiwari, sir. Bacho, I have started the Commerce Maths by Practical series. I already covered six practicals. Please watch it, write it, and do it practice. Go to the playlist, we will do the full playlist. Bacho. You will get all the practicals which was already released. Now, today lecture, we are going to solve practical number seven. That is application of linear regression. Now be ready everyone. Welcome back everyone. Before starting numericals, go through these important formulas and concepts. Revise it, learn it and do the practice of numericals. These are the properties of regression coefficients. Let us ready for numerical number one. Application of linear regression activity number one. Now, what is the question? Given that x bar equal to 20, y bar equal to 25, standard deviation of x2, standard deviation of y3 and r, that is correlation coefficient is 0 0.75. Calculate bx. We know that, bacho, bx is r into sigma y upon sigma x. Sigma means standard deviation of y upon standard deviation of x. Data is given. Substitute. What is r? 0 0.75. So we will write 0 0.75 multiply. What is standard deviation of y? That is 3. Upon what is standard deviation of x? That is 2. Calculate this. You will get the answer is 1.125. Similarly, what is bxy? bxy is r into standard deviation of x upon standard deviation of y. Substitute all the values, you will get 0 0.5. Now, what is the regression equation of y on x? In the previous practical, I explained you ki, what is the formula for byx that is y on x ka regression equation. That is y minus y bar is equal to byx x minus x bar. We have x bar, we have y bar. We calculated byx. Substitute here, you will get the regression equation y is equal to 1.125x plus 2.5. Similarly, what is the regression equation of x on y? That is x minus x bar is equal to bxy y minus y bar. We have x bar, y bar and we calculated bxy. Substitute all the values. You will get regression equation. That is x is equal to 0 0.5 y plus 7.5. Next question. Variance of x equal to 9. There are two regression equations. This is y on x and this is x on y. What we have to calculate? We have to calculate x bar and y bar. Solve both the equations simultaneously. See here, यहाँ पे हमने दोनों equation को simultaneously solve किया. यहाँ पे 40x है, यहाँ पे 8x है ना? तो equation number one में हम लोग क्या करेंगे बच्चों? Equation number one में multiply by five कर दो. You will get 40x, 8 five जा 40. 40x minus 45 plus 66 into 40. 66 into five, that is 330. So this is the equation and this is second equation. Solve both the equation, you will get y equal to 70. And you will get substitute value of y in any one of this equation. You will get value of y that is value of y is 17 and you will get value of x is 13. So y equal to 17 and x equal to 13. In the pra previous practical, I have told you that the y ki value is y bar and the x ki value is x bar. Bolte we get x bar is 13 and y bar is 17. And this x bar comma y bar is called as point of intersection of both the regression lines. Next question. Uh, continue, bacho. same question continue. Now x bar is 13, y bar is 17. We have to find regression equation y on x. What is the regression equation of y on x? It is given 8x minus 10y plus 66 is 0. Now, whenever regression equation is y on x, so we will convert our equation in terms of y is equal to. Aapko y equal to ke formula na hai. In the previous practical, aap dhyan se dekhi hai. Mainne aapko wahan pe sare ideas bataya hai. Ki y on x ko kaise convert karte hai. So, solve this equation in terms of y is equal to. So y equal to, you will get 8x upon 10 plus 66 upon 10. The coefficient of x, jo aapke x ka coefficient hai. That is 8 upon 10. That is called as dyx. Similarly, Aapko yaha pe x on y chahiye. Aap x equal to ke form mein laoge. And the coefficient of y that is 18 by 40 is called as bxy. Once we get byx and bxy, 
we are going to calculate r. What is r? r equal to plus minus under root bx into bxy. Now, see here, bx and bx, bx and bxy, both are positive. Dono positive hai bacho. If both are positive, r ki value positive leni hai aapko. Keep in mind, bx, bxy, both positive, then r is positive. bx and bxy, both negative, then r is negative. In our case, bx and bxy both positive, therefore r is positive. We consider positive sign. So plus under the root, substitute bys and bxy, solve, you will get r key value 0 0.6. You will get r key value 0 0.6. Now the next part of the sum. Now we are going to calculate variance of y is given. Variance of y is 9. What is variance? So y variance of y is 9. What, what is the standard deviation? Standard deviation is under root variance. So you will get under root 9, which is 3. Remember it, square root of 9 plus minus 3 hota hai. But standard deviation is never negative. Standard deviation is never negative. So standard deviation is positive 3. Now what is bx? Bx is equal to r into sigma y upon sigma x. Substitute all the values you will get sigma y. That is the standard deviation of y is 4. Next sum. For the bivariate data, x bar equal to this, y bar equal to this, by x given, bx y given, find the correlation coefficient. What is the meaning of correlation coefficient? That is r. And what is r? r is under root by x into bx y. Okay. So now we have by x and bx y. See here, both are negative. So r ki value kya aadagi bacho? r ki value aadagi negative. We get R key value minus 0.6. Now, estimate Y. Jabi bhi aapko estimate Y bolega, use Y on X. Or jabi bhi aapko estimate X bolega, use X on Y. So, using Y on X, we get Y key value 33.5. And using X on Y, we get X key value 53.6. Let us proceed to the next sum. And one advertisement expenditure but so this type of problem is very important for practical purpose as well as board exam purpose advertisement expenditure that is x sale y what is arithmetic mean arithmetic mean is x bar and y bar yeah x diya hai bacho so yeah x bar ho gaya yahan pe y diya hai yeah ho gaya y bar my dear student standard deviation yeah x hai so yeah standard deviation of x ho gaya students yeah standard deviation of y ho gaya now we have x bar is equal to 10 y bar is equal to 90, standard deviation of x 3, standard deviation of y 12. And correlation coefficient is also given. That is r is equal to 0 0.8. That is r equal to 0 0.8. Now, first, obtain the two regression equation. What is the two regression equation? That is y on x and x on x on y. y on x and x on y. Now, what is x bar, y bar? All these are given. Now, what is BYX? BYX is R into sigma X plus sigma Y. From here, you will calculate B, BXY. BXY is equal to R into sigma X upon sigma Y. From here, you will calculate BXY is equal to 0 0.8 into 3 by 12. You will get 0 0.2. After BXY, we are going to calculate BYX. What is BYX? BYX is equal to R into sigma Y by sigma X. Substitute all the values. You will get BYX is 3.2. Now, regression equation y on x. That is y minus y bar equal to by x, x minus x bar. Substitute all the values. You will get y is equal to 3.2 x plus 58. Similarly, calculate regression equation x on y. x minus x bar equal to bxy, y minus y bar. You will get x is equal to 0 0.2 y minus 8. After calculating regression equation y on x and x on y, question me kya hai? Question dekhye. Pucha gaya hai. What is the likely sale? Aapko sale pucha gaya hai. Here sales is denoted by y. Well, aapko y pucha gaya hai. Aur aapko x ki value di gaya hai 15. In the third part, aapko sales diya gaya hai 120. That means, aapko y ki value di gaya hai 120. Aur aapko pucha gaya hai advertising budget. That means, aapko x pucha gaya hai question mark. In the third question, x equal to question mark and y equal to 120. And in the second question, x is equal to 15 and y equal to question mark. Whenever we y find out, karna hoga, use regression equation y on x. And when we find x, karna hoga, use regression equation x on y. So in x on y equation, put y equal to 12, 
and in y on x equation put x equal to 15. Let us proceed. So here y on x, up there, sir, you put x equal to 15. Where we have to put x equal to 15 in y on x. Because we have to find y find karna hai. Y find karna hai, to x ki value put karo. Or jab x find out karna hai, to y ki value put karo. Refer it and solve it. Let us proceed to the next question. We have two regression equation. 2x plus 3y minus 6 is 0. 5x plus 7y minus 12 is equal to 0. Now, what we have to calculate correlation coefficient, that is r. Now, for r, it is necessary that find b, y, x and b, x, y. Now, this is the first equation. 2x plus 3y minus 6 is equal to 0. We have to find y. Nikala. The x ka coefficient is b, y, x. X ka coefficient is b, y, x. So, here b, y, x is minus 2 by 3. In the second equation, x is equal to, is ko x ke form mein laenge. We get x equal to minus 7 by 5, y plus 12 by 5. Y ka coefficient jo hai bacho, that is called as b, x, y. Now, we get b, y, x and b, x, y. Find r. What is r plus minus under root b, y, x into b, x, y. Substitute both the values. See here, b, y, x is negative, b, x, y is negative. Therefore, r ki value is also negative. Finally, we R ki value mil gai minus 0 0.96. Now, what is the second part? Sigma x by sigma y. Now, what is b y x? B, either you can use b y x or b x y. Dono mein se aap koi bhi formula use kar sakte ho. Here, I will use b x y. B x y is equal to r into sigma x by sigma y. So, sigma x upon sigma y is equal to, is equal to, now, what is b x y? See here, b x y humne calculate kiya hai. B x y is minus 7 by 5. So, यहाँ पे आप लिख दीजिए minus 7 by 5. यहाँ पे आपका B x y हो गया. इस formula में से बच्चों, what we did, या R को upon में ले लिया. So, B x y upon R is sigma x by sigma y. We get this. Now, what is B x y? B x y is minus 7.5. And what is R? Minus 0 0.96. Minus minus cancel. You will get sigma x upon sigma y. That is the standard deviation of x upon standard deviation of y is 1.4583. Proceed to next. Uh, okay, but over. In the next lecture, we are going to solve practical number. This is practical number 7 we completed. In the next lecture, we are going to solve practical number 8. Please all solve all the practicals carefully. Do the practice. All these problems are very important for practical purposes as well as board exam purpose. Okay, bye everyone, like it, subscribe it and share it. Bye everyone.